the only thing that's really changed is now it's on a base. It's on a dolly right now, just so I can move it around easily. Because it doesn't really work very well right now. It pulls a lot of current. Uh, before when I ran it, it didn't even try to trip the 15 amp, the 15 amp breaker, which the fridge and the uh, four fluorescent bulbs were running on also. Uh, but now it trips a 13 amp breaker really quickly. So it it's pulls it's pulling a lot of uh, current. Uh, the choke right now is a neon transformer, which is at uh, it's 12,000 volts. So I hope it'll withstand the uh, estimated 20,000 volt peak voltage or at least that's what uh steve connor got which this is his basic schematic and i thank him for putting that schematic on the website all right hopefully the lights don't turn that light doesn't turn off on me <clears throat> i can't run it for long at a time i mean for very long at a time because um breaker trip's really easy It still requires a ton of tuning. It needs a new charging choke because it's using too much current. Uh, the tank capacitance is still only 15 nanofarads. Uh, that's why I can use such high brakes per second because low capacitance. The top load is hot. Really hot. Wow. I wouldn't have expected that. Oh no, the light turned off. Secondary is a little bit warm at the bottom of it and that's about it